So I want to say hi to all of you guys. I don't know if you guys remember me or not. I haven't been on my YouTube channel in a, about a year. It's been a really long time. And I'm, I just, I felt compelled to make a video and kind of catch up with my followers here if you're still around. Um, and this feels so weird to be back. Um, I'm filming in my beauty room today. Um, kind of changed it up a bit, but today's video, and I, I don't want to ramble on because I'm going to be all over the place because I haven't done this in a really long time, but if you guys are following me on Instagram, I've been really active on Instagram and I've been keeping up with all my followers from YouTube there since I haven't been making any videos, but um, I felt compelled to make a video today because I bought a new Chanel bag and I wanted to share my experience with you guys and I have a Chanel bag, so I had to show you guys. Um, I'm, I don't even know where to start, but this was such a hassle. This bag was so hard to get. Um, I could not get the bag from the store. I had a particular color in mind, and I went through hoops to find this bag. Um, you know, there's like a list for Chanel and all that stuff, and I was just like not about that life, and it was like really annoying. So I ended up just ordering it online and getting it um, authenticated and everything. Uh, and I'm so happy with this bag. So let me just show you how it looks. Chanel. So I got the pink, I, I should have not worn this orange shirt. Let me see if I can show you it this way, the pink. It's gorgeous. It's almost like a bubblegum pink. This is the mini flap. This is my first mini flap. I've never had one before. Um, I'm about to turn 40, so I treated myself. It is gorgeous. I actually have like something in it to keep it in shape. Um, I don't have anything in it because I've had it stored, but it is gorgeous. I love it. Um, it's lambskin with the silver hardware. Um, yeah, I've only worn this bag, I want to say twice so far. And here's, <laughs> this is why I'm making this video because I want to talk about this bag and how delicate and fragile these bags are. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you know, <laughs> I party, I have a lot of friends, I'm always out, people. Um, this is not the ideal bag you want to get if you're not really, like if you beat up your bags, this thing won't survive. I would really, I mean, I don't like the concept of having to baby a bag. I feel like a bag is meant to be used, but I guess when you pay a certain amount of money, you start to be really, really careful. But even then, I'm like, I don't, I still don't know if I'm going to be able to handle this yet. Um, but so far, I was tipsy twice when I was with this bag and it still, it still survived. I got a little bit, just, I don't even think you can notice, but I got a little bit of black transfer already because I love to wear this bag with black. And I also coated it with, um... Carbon Pro. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Carbon Pro, but it protects the leather So I sprayed it and treated it to prevent it from getting any stains and stuff um, And it went that went well. I treated it. I did my homework and everything um, It's not too bad It's not too bad, but I think it's just gonna happen and I just can't get myself so crazy. I also like, you could also use like a baby wipe to wipe the back too. So that's kind of what I do whenever I feel like it's looking a little darker. Just put a little bit of, of a very, like a, of the organic type of baby wipe. Um, but I love this bag and you guys have been following my journey about this bag. Look at how pretty, this is the mini. So it has the pocket in the back. It has a zipper pocket here. 
then another pocket here you can't really fit much in here but at least my biggest concern was being able to fit my phone um, I just fit my phone my wallet my keys and a lipstick like pretty much basic stuff but oh my god <laughs> she's all beautiful look at how pretty uh, um also what other complaints so far my review on this is it does get scratched up uh lambskin will get scratched up and i've scratched it up already so that's great um but they say you could kind of like somewhat buff it out if you wanted to so i haven't tried to yet but it definitely i mean you can't see it i mean the good thing is you can't tell now but i can tell that i've scuffed it a little bit but um it does scuff guys definitely does scuff um but i feel like lambskin will always look better than caviar in my opinion um i just feel like it just looks more luxurious i don't i'm i, I definitely am a lambskin girl even and it, and like i said they say it's not as durable as caviar but i still feel like it's pretty i feel like it's still like i don't know like the quality is still pretty good and it's i don't know i think it's all the same shit to be honest I mean, you can't, I guess, I don't know, I guess, I guess caviar can take more of a beat up than this, I guess. Um, I've had a caviar Chanel tote years, years ago, and it definitely survived a lot, but I just, I don't know, I'm biased. I really like this one. So I just wanted to share my bag with you guys. Here she is. So this is my first video and I wanted to share. I got her, oh, by the way, I got her on, on Poshmark, there's another thing, um, I got her on Poshmark. They have a new authentication um, procedure now to authenticate everything. Oh, and let me show you what else came in the pack in the box before I forget. So, get the box. It comes with a wipe, so you just and then it you know it says Chanel, and then you just put your hand in here and you just like wipe it when you want to wipe it that comes with that it came with an actual booklet on how to take care of it which i studied <laughs> um it came with the authentication from poshmark the girl the the seller left all the pretty stuff in it like i have the little flowers here i have the ribbon the original ribbon that it came with And of course, you cannot forget the authentication card that is everything. Like, you need to have this for this bag. So I keep it in the box. And I usually just, when I'm not using this bag, I just put it away in the box, you know, until I decide to use it and stuff. But, um, so happy with my bag. I wanted to share with you so like i said i feel like you know it's worth it i'm very happy with it i got a great deal actually i'm really proud i did did my homework um next i already have my next one i want to i want a small a small one this is the mini i want the small one which is a little bigger um i just don't know what color i want it in yet but anyways this was it this is my motivator to make this video i wanted to share with you guys my chanel bag um Comment below, oh, do me a huge favor. Um, please down below, tell me videos that you guys would love to see. I'm back in the game again, and I I want to give you content that you guys would watch and also be, in things that you'd be interested in watching and things that I'd be excited to make. So um, it's so nice to see you guys again. Um, I hope you like this video. It was, I was trying to be really quick, like I don't want anything too long because I don't want to lose your interest <laughs> and you guys get bored from my content. But I just wanted to share my bag. I'm pretty sure some other people will, I guess, um, enjoy the information about this bag. Again, I vouch for Poshmark. If you're looking to buy a pre-owned bag um, or a new bag, whatever the case may be, like that is a place to go. I i'm really really happy with how this worked out so i love you guys and i'll see you next